Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Get Wrecked. It is the morning of day 24. I've got a few skill points to spend here this morning. I'm going two points into Perception. This way I can put the third point into Demolitions Expert Level 2, which will allow us now to craft a uh, Level 3 Launcher, which I've got the parts to do that. And I will get that crafted tonight, and we'll go revisit the library tomorrow. This morning, though, we're going to go see Jen, because she's got Tier 4 jobs for us. So, let's see how many of these we can bang out today. What's up, Jen? You're looking kind of rough. <laughs> Thanks, I appreciate that. You didn't get bit, did you? I did get bit, a few times. But that's okay, because I got honey. I just drink that, and I'm fine. Selling you all this stuff. I usually sell all this stuff on trader day but my sell inventory chest is overflowing so i had to get rid of some of this shit look at this almost a full stack of coin and how did i miss this gunpowder and shotgun shells inventory doesn't restock until day 25 maybe i just skipped that stuff i'm gonna buy five time charges so we have a full stack now and uh we don't need that, but maybe I'll buy it anyway, just because I'm trying to max all these books out. All right, let's read that book and take a look at those jugs. Jobs. I'm a doctor. Or both. We can look at both. Um, hold on. Uh, that's still the tier two opening trader route. I guess I can't move on to the next opening trader route until I do that one and whatever. Anyway, uh, let's just do a uh, clear zombies. That's easier Hi, than clear and fetch. Hurry back soon. And I will. Nice oh, a nice reward. Totally going to be something I don't need. Here we are. Flowers and shoes. My wife would love this store, even though it looks like a shithole. Um, well, shoes is open. So is this door. Got stairs going up and mailboxes. What is this, an apartment building also? Anything back here? Well, stairs going down. Let's start with the uh, shoe store. See what's going on over here. Here we are. What? What happened there? Did I hit the shoe rack? Come on out then. That's it for him, and that's it for her. Well, a bunch of shoe racks in here. We don't really need shoes. What are we wearing? Padded boots? Yeah. I could use some military boots. Those would be nice. I don't think we're going to find them in shoe racks, though. We probably need to find those in, like, good loot or buy them at the trader. Yeah. All right. Enough of that. Let's see what else is going on in here. Ooh, little parking garage. There's a zombie. He dead. Got a full car here. I guess we'll take it apart. I don't really need the parts, but I could use an engine or a battery. So let's see if we can get either of those things. Oh, got an engine. I'll scrap the pipes and the springs. Uh, and the radiator. Let's pop this open. Take all that stuff. Drop off this stuff. Uh, I'll keep the plastic parts. We could use those. This must be the flower store. Oh, close that. Not much going on in here. Some potted plants, some cactus over there. I mean, we could take the cactus out for some yucca if we really wanted to, but I'm good. There's some trash. That's it. Really, one nail. Oh, this was worth it. All right, then. I guess we're going upstairs or downstairs. Which way should we go first? Downstairs? Okay. Oh, boy. Zombies in that room. Zombies in this room, too. Oop. There we go. 
Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought I killed that guy. Now nah, we're good. Except for the ones in this room. Of course. There we go. We clear now? Nope. A couple of little crawlers. Oh, that was a spider monkey. Is that down here or upstairs? Must be upstairs. Well, I don't know how deep this goes. Whoop, oh, here he is. Maybe we should go upstairs before we go down in the sewers or wherever that hole leads. Well, let's see what's over here first. Laundry room. And this is a dead end. All right. Before we venture further down, let's clear the upstairs. Okay. Oh. Get out of here, Kenny. You know your ass got evicted. Let's see what we got. Okay. More zombies is what we got. Probably should be using the crossbow, but whatever. How was your trip, buddy? Not so good? Well, you gotta walk down those steps. You can't just dive head first. Nope, Dick is sliding down the steps. And now he's getting up. Shit. Batter up book. Metal chain mod. I'll read it, but it's useless to me. Another spider zombie around here. I'll use that. There he is! I heard you coming. Let's grab that can. Let's grab the can. Good on the electrical parts. I got a bunch of those from when we took apart all those uh, uh, washing machines at the laundromat. There we go. Up. Oh. Woke up some more. I want that biker, though. Got him. They all got to be coming out of this room, right? Yep. There we go. You know, the stun baton definitely doesn't deserve the hate all of us creators give it. But, even though I've said it multiple times in this series, it's certainly not the best weapon. Oh, shit. Damn it. I mean, when it's charged up, it's great for stopping dogs in their tracks, you know what I mean? But with the Stun Repulsor mod and Electrocutioner damn near maxed out, it's not really worth it. I certainly would have rather put those points into Skull Crusher and had a Sledgehammer. Does much better work. I mean, if you had a group of people you were playing with, I wouldn't mind at least one of them taking on Electrocutioner and going for the stun baton. This way you have at least one person in your group that can shock the shit out of some zombies when need be. But running this thing solo, as I always do, I'd much prefer the sledgehammer and then the club. But it's also nice to switch things up every now and again. Heard you coming, lady. Fine, I'll eat the blueberries. There were seven more in uh, one of these other cabinets. I'll grab them. 14 blueberries. That'll get our hunger filled back up, I think. Here they are. Ah, the uh, robotic drone medic mod schematic. Now we just need a drone. Good on those goth boots. Nothing there. All right, I think there's one more room down here, and then we can head upstairs. Take that iron. Got a crate in here. Let's pop that open. Level 1 auger. I'm just going to scrap that, though. I don't think it's worth it. doesn't hit very hard. And all it's going to do is attract screamers. Scrap it for the motor tool parts, which I usually call machine tool parts. That's a problem I have. I got it from my mother, where I just make up words for shit. Oh, well, here's the top floor, and we have rooftop access right there. Let's clear these rooms first. Uh, this door frame's probably going to stop 
this bolt. Yep. Give me that thing. Got her. Whoop. Oh, that was nice. Hey, fellas. Three's a crowd, huh? Come on. A hard time hitting that little guy. Yes. That's more like it. All right. Just taking him down. We're good. With the coffee and some canned ravioli. Beautiful. Ooh, level 6 ratchet. Here, let me upgrade this door real quick so I can go through my inventory in peace. Uh, eat that. Scrap that. I'll replace my ratchet with that one later. And I don't need that blood bag. I'll drop it off right in here. Nah, I don't care about any of this stuff. Let's get up on the rooftop and see what's going on up there. Bunch of zombies. Come on down, folks. That was fun. We should totally make an underground base. I'm sure we got to drop down right there. Because there was a door all boarded up. Down below, I'm sure that this whole leads into that room. God knows what we're dropping into. There's some loot. So that's good. Could be a bunch of zombies, though. Well, only one way to find out. Well, there's a way out. So, no big deal. And I think... We're clear. And here's the main loot. Oh, duh, we are clear. It says we're clear. We can return to the trader and get our reward. So I guess there is nothing going on in the basement. I'll still go down and check it out because there was uh, a flashlight pointing to that hole in the wall. Let's grab this loot and then we'll see what was going on down there. Hey, there are those military boots. Level six at that. Gonna replace these padded pieces of junk with those. Nice. Well, I mean, I don't expect to find any zombies down here because the area is clear. There's nothing that way. There is what seems to be a cave this way. Oh, no, it just ends. All right, there's nothing down here. I mean, unless you lived here and you wanted to turn that into, like, uh, you know, your mine or whatever, that'd be cool. Anyway, let's get back to Jen's and get our reward. She said she was going to have a nice one for us. Well, that didn't take long. Oh, that is pretty nice. Level 5 steel sledge, but I don't need it, so I'm just going to sell it back to you. With this stuff also. Alright. Let's do that other clear zombies. And um, being at tier 4. That's probably the last job we're going to do today. Be careful. And Be careful. Try not to get yourself killed. And don't get killed. Solid advice, Jen. The pink palace again. Alright, whatever. We'll just do a speed run. All we gotta do is kill all the zombies, and we know where the loot is this time. Clear. I missed one of them birds. Still hear it flying around out there. Can we get some first aid? Yes. Starting to pile up at the door. Okay. We're good. Laundry room. Blammo. Clear. Um, do we go for the wall safes? I don't know. 
I mean, I do have these, um... What do you call it? Time charges. We might as well, right? Got any behind the paintings? No. Just this one. Alright. Let's pop it open. Oh, shit! We destroyed it! What the hell? I wasn't destroying them last time. Let's clear these rooms and uh, try that again. We are clear. Maybe not in the laundry room. Yep. That's where he came from. Alright, we're good. Check behind these paintings. Nope. There's one right here, though. Let me try this again real fast. Ah, destroyed it! What the hell? Oh, you know what it is? I put another point into Demolitions Expert. So that increased the amount of damage that all explosives do. That's why they're destroying those safes now. All right. We'll take the lockpicks instead. Oh, shit. Come on, man. I was about to break into that thing. Little bastard. Damn it. Breaking all my lockpicks here. Come on. Nice. Loot was not that nice. Well, there go all my lockpicks. I mean, yes, we could beat into it. But you know what? This is just supposed to be a speed run. We can't be beating into all these wall safes. Let's just eliminate the zombies and we'll get the main stash at the end. Bookshelf. I gotta, gotta loot the bookshelf. See? There's always books you don't know. Scrap that wood club. Get out of here, lady. Mm, took his head off. Bathrooms are usually clear in here. Can I get another coffee? Nope. Laundry room. Clear. Clear. It's a backpack. Probably shouldn't have closed ourselves in here because I hear a bunch more zombies coming our way. I'll take the rifle part. No shit. Sweet. Oh, yeah. There are dogs up here. Mm. Shit. Get up there. Oh, my God. I'm stuck. That was not good. We should have went up the other way. These birds screwed us over. Oh, my God. Bleeding. This is not how you do the rooftop here. Oh, shit. There are more dogs around. Get this bird out of here. Shit. Okay. Oh, my God. Not good. We gotta go. I'm just jumping off. That was rough. We're still bleeding. <laughs> we are bleeding. We got a concussion. We got a broken arm. We're infected. We should have went this way. Could have took the zombies out real easy, like this. There's the bird. I think the bird is actually below us. The dogs. We need to take care of the dogs. Now, you know what? The dogs can't get up to us. Right? No. They can't get up here. They don't know how to use ladders. Let's go around the other way. Pop these open. We'll grab the loot, and then we got to take care of the dogs, obviously, because that's part of the job. But first, let's 
get all this crap. You know what? I'm putting a hatch down right here. Because you never know <laughs> with this game. Barb rolling book, we'll just read it. Oh, hey, officer. Can I ask why you pulled me over? Speeding? Well, it's a speed run, asshole. Get up. Okay. These dogs really put the pressure on you when they don't shut up. We're almost done. We just got a crack in here, and the explosives are in the bike. Oh, come on. You know what? We'll deal with the dogs right here and right now. Here they come. Uh, what? Did that work? No. It did not. We'll try standing back a little further. Get all this stuff out of the way. That little bit of damage I did to it. Because of... Come on, lady. Seriously, I've got to put the hatch up. I'm such an idiot. Um, all right, let's try this again. I was hitting it with the pickaxe earlier. What the hell? It just disappears into the fifth dimension. Oh, this is some bullshit. Well, I'm not wasting anymore. We'll just finish beating into it. I started beating into it, and then I was like, ah, screw it. I'll just go get the explosives. And as you see, we just wasted... A few of them, so now I'm beating into it again. Chili dog recipe and some more time charges to make up for the ones we wasted. All right, let's get back to Jen's. I'm back. Now that you have some money to Ooh, spend, level 5 compound bow. Sale for the rest of it's the not game. as good as the compound crossbow, though. So I'm going to stick with the compound crossbow. It is better than the steel leg armor, though, in terms of price. Um, I'm not going to take another job. Because tomorrow, we're going to start off by... Getting some redemption over at the library, and I'm not sure how long that's going to take us. Alright, let's use a plaster cast. And uh, let's just use an antibiotic. We found the herbal antibiotics recipe, so we can craft some of those. Yeah. Yeah. And look how cheap they are if we do it in the chem station. Okay, well, base is looking good. It's nice and repaired and upgraded, so if we do get a horde tomorrow night, we should be fine. I expanded it a little bit, and I plan to expand it even more. Maybe I'll do some of that tonight. I put in this wood wall right here, because I knocked out the cobblestone wall, and I just put this wood wall in as temporary to keep zombies from jumping up here, the spider zombies. And then when we expand it, I'll knock the wood wall down, and we'll put up another one. Which, like I said, I might do that tonight. Bring it out maybe four, five more blocks. And we're going to have just tons of support holding this up. And we're going to be just fine. All right, guys. So I'm going to spend the rest of the night uh, organizing and putting away this inventory. Uh, tomorrow is trader day. They do restock tomorrow. So I'll see what I can sell and I'll put that shit into the motorcycle. But as I said, I am going to get a rocket launcher crafted tonight. And we're going to start things off in the next episode by getting some redemption at the library. So I hope you're looking forward to that. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching and all of the support. You guys are the best. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Get Wrecked, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.
Thank you.